Hey guys, it's Rianne, and if you are suffering from maskne, well, I can relate. Maskne would be the words mask and acne, brangelina together. So something that's super important when you're talking about the masks themselves is you wanna make sure they are made of a breathable material. Something like cotton is a really good choice. Um, and if you're a little bit worried because you have sensitive skin like I do, um, a great idea is to check and see what fabric your favorite pillowcase is made of um, because then you kind of already know that that fabric won't irritate your skin even further. Um, I'm someone who has to wash everything before I wear it because I get eczema really badly as well. So don't forget if you do buy masks to wash them before you wear them. I'm gonna talk more about the masks that I personally purchase and love at the end of the video, but if you are already have your masks all purchased um, and you're just here for maskne tips, I figured we'd jump into that. When it comes to maskne, the most important thing is to hydrate your skin. Hydration, hydration, hydration. And what I love for that is hyaluronic acid. Uh, my favorite one is by The Ordinary. It's hyaluronic acid 2% plus vitamin B5. Less than $10 and it's a hero product for me as it is. It can be so tempting when you have a maskne breakout to treat it like a regular breakout and use something drying like a salicylic acid, but Dermatologists say things like that can actually make the problem worse because you need to be hydrating your skin rather than drying it out. So hyaluronic acid is amazing. You can use it alone. You can use it over your moisturizer that is tried and true. Um, and it will just give you that extra protection layer of hydration. So as far as preventing maskne, this is my top go-to. I'm sure the last thing that you want is for your maskne to get even more irritated. And because we don't really have the luxury of not wearing a mask for a few days while our maskne clears up before we have to wear a mask again, um, something that I've really, really been relying on are these Chorus X acne patches. These are another hero product for me, but basically they will not only prevent your mask from becoming contaminated, although you'll probably wash it anyway, um, they also create a protective barrier over your mask knee. So you're not irritating it further or leaving it open to become infected. And that's something where if you're wearing a mask, it's more likely to happen. Um, the other great thing is these start to heal the mask knee and you know, you could put your mask on over your acne patch and nobody has to know. So my favorite masks are by Everlane. They are made out of cotton. They say 100% human on the side and they are the kind that loop behind your ears. They're super easy to just pop on and pop off. They come in a set of five, which has been great for me because I just feel like it's worked really well with planning and laundry and all of that. Um, and they also make them in gray. You can get a pack of black and gray and they also have a multicolor tie dye. I hope you found this video helpful. Best of luck with your mask knee. Thank you so much for wearing a mask and protecting yourself and others. And thank you so much for watching. If you like beauty, fashion, and travel videos, don't forget to subscribe. And you can follow me on Instagram. It's at Rianne Star. Thank you so, so much. And I will talk to you very soon. Bye.